Welcome back once again, folks, to my NCAA 14 football dynasty mode. <clears throat> we are already 10 weeks into the season. And this is a crazy, crazy SEC matchup uh, that I got for you guys. As you can already see, it's the number one ranked Georgia Bulldogs versus the 25 ranked Florida Gators. This is actually a game I've been looking forward to uh, pretty much since I created the schedule <clears throat> when I first got the game. So let's go on ahead and head down to the field and get into the action, shall we? So I decided to receive kickoffs underway. Oh, yeah, I'm taking that. That's not even a deep kick. Oh, nice little return by battle. 20, 24 yards on the pickup. There's the man. You guys already know. I've already been pumping them up pretty much every video since about week three, week four. Jeffrey Hemfield. <laughs> See if we can get him going early today. Hemfield with the handoff. Oh, breaks a tackle. There we go. Nice little 11-yard pickup on the first run of the day. That's exactly the start that he wanted. See if we can make that magic happen once again. Another handoff to Hemfield. Ah, there was a hole, but ah, I got tackled. After gaining three, whatever, we'll take it. It's still positive yardage. Bringing up a second and seven. See if we can air this out just a little bit here. Put the receiver in motion. They look to be playing some kind of zone. Yep. Nice catch by Jones across the middle of the field for a six yard pickup. Coming up with the third and inch. See if we can pick this up on the ground. And of course we do. And Henfield, off left tackle, makes a nice little seven yard pickup. So three rushes early, 20, 21 yards off of three rushes early for Henfield. Couldn't ask for a better start. Hand off to Johnson. And this dude starts fumbling as soon as he takes the handoff. I don't know what that was about. Let's put Hemfield back in, man. I don't know about this Johnson cat. Apparently, I do hear he's pretty good, though. Um, I forget his real name, but in real life, the uh, backup to Hemfield or Todd Gurley is actually pretty good. That's what my uh, my Georgia brother tell me. Nice little pickup by Battle. 16 yards off the catch. This is a pretty solid drive so far. About 58 seconds to go in the first quarter. Nice little toss to Hemfield. Oh, he found the hole. He's going. There's nobody even there. And dives into the end zone. Let's go. That's exactly how we want to start. Nice little 31-yard touchdown run. Kicking off. That's a pretty deep kick. I don't think he's bringing that out. Nope. Let's see what they do on their first drive. See if our D wants to come up and stand up. Not let them answer the score. Dang, he has all day to throw back there. Ah, uh, tries to throw it to his wide out and he drops the pass. Heard those footsteps coming. Got nervous. Brings up a second and ten. Coming out in the eye. Hands the ball off to the back. Gary. Or carry. <laughs> nice little six yard pickup. Here we go, fellas. Third and four. They're coming out in the shotgun. Looks like three wide, <clears throat> four wide, excuse me. Didn't see that bunch set on the right side. Oh, and they convert. Come on, man. Let's go. Uh, so it brings up a first and 10 after they convert it. Off the nice pass to come out in the pistol. Hand off to the running back, Gary, up the middle. Oh, runs the linebacker over. Come on, man. What are you guys scared of got a contact out here? So that wraps up the first quarter. Georgia Bulldogs up 7-0. But Florida is marching right now, so I'm a little nervous about that. We need our defense to step up here and get a stop. They're on second and inches. See if I can generate some pl uh, pressure here with this blitz. Oh, drops back, passes it, man's wide open. Oh, and he missed the tackle. Oh, come on, man. Yeah, you know, you take the blitz sometimes, you gamble and you get burned. I mean, that's just how it works, right? There's no coverage for that once you send all those linebackers. Bringing up a first and 10 pass play. Finds an open receiver, Williams. Nice tackle from behind by my defender. 
Bringing up a second and five. We're already in the second quarter. Time is already ticking down. Got about two minutes and 25 seconds to go. I may consider making um, next season's games a little bit longer. What do you guys think about that? Oh my gosh, as the quarterback just takes off and runs for 18 yards. Come on, fellas. Let's go, defense. Got this undefeated record at stake right now. Handoff to Gary. Stuffed in the backfield. We'll take it. Well, he gained about three yards, but still, it's pretty much nothing. Next play, they come out in the shotgun. Second and goal. Fake the handoff. Johnson's going for the run. Oh, and he gets laid out. <laughs> Quarterback's going to think twice next time about holding on to that ball. Trying to run it. The linebacker laid him out. Almost put him to sleep. And Johnson just throw. Oh, come on. That's the biggest load of crap I've ever seen. Give it up. Give it up for the CPU cheese right there. Props to you. I don't even know how he saw that guy. I didn't even see him. But he was wide open. Anyway, so we're tied 7-7 off the kickoff. Craziness. See if we can get our second drive to match our first one with the score. Hand off to him. Phil hit the left side. Oh, my gosh. Oh, he shook the hell out of that dude. He's still running. Let's go. <laughs> nice pickup, baby. Nice pickup. And Phil just took the rock, hit the hole on the left side, and was gone. That's definitely making the ESPN highlight reel tonight for sure. Oh, he's get oh he's getting back up. <laughs> Gotta love that infinity engine right there. I thought he was down, dude. Got back up and tried to run. So it brings up a second and five. See if we can air it out, son. Kirkpatrick dropping back. Oh, he has a guy. He's going deep. Oh, what? He caught that? Oh, he caught it. Wow. I mean, I saw the one-on-one -on -one coverage. That's why I let it go. Expecting my guy to make a play against the corner. And somehow it looks like the ball was overthrown. DB's in perfect position to make the interception. And my wide receiver catches the tip. Wow. What a play. <laughs> That's just insane. So you see this game's already off to a crazy start, man. Who knows how this one's going to wrap up as we kick the ball off. Touchback. So they're coming out for the third series of the game today. Coming out in the shotgun set. See if we can force a three and out here, fellas. As the quarterback tries to take off and run, but goes nowhere. Sacked for a loss of one by Wayne Luke. Second down. Second and 11, they're coming out. QB's under center. I'm guessing run here. They're changing the play. Oh, oh, he did hand it off. Yep. My assumption was correct. Good job, defense. So that brings up a third and long. QB out in the shotgun. Hands it off to the back. And the back is in space. Ah, uh, brings up a fourth and seven. Yeah, we should stop the clock here just to see if we can get one more shot. And they're punting. Four seconds, three seconds, two seconds. Runs out of bounds just to stop the clock. I, I don't know. But I always like to give my, my, my wide receiver at least a shot to make a play at the end of the half. Because you never know, man. There was actually a game, I forget who it was against earlier in the season, but I did the same exact thing. My wide out ended up coming down with a tug. So passes up in the air. Oh, that's short. He caught it, though. But... Whatever, so we're taking it in the halftime. Up seven, score is 14-7 right now. Pretty decent start. So uh, since I received, I'm kicking off in the second half. And they're taking a touchback on that. Let's bring the ball out to the 20. Let's see if Florida's gonna answer the score here. Coming out in the shotgun. First and 10. Finds a man that's wide open, it's the back. And he's off to the races. Wow. What a lapse in defense, defensive coverage right there. So after the uh, long pass play in the... Oh, he throws the ball right out of bounds. <laughs> this guy didn't even try. He just knew the play was dead the moment he snapped the ball and just threw it out of bounds. Craziness. So now we're looking at second and 10. It's a handoff to the back and gets blown up in the backfield by the linebacker. There we go, baby. Way to shoot the gap. 
Nice job. Brings up a third and long. Third and 14 to be exact. Oh, they're coming out trying to air this out. Let's go. Let's go, defense. QB drops back, throws it. Oh, give me that. Let's go, dummy. He threw it right to me. Nice pick. Nice pick by the cornerback, number five. That's exactly what we needed. Forced a turnover. Nice job. So we're getting the ball back after the interception. At about the uh, our 40-yard line. First play is a handoff to Hemfield, and he gets tackled just about instantly. So that's a short gain, gain of a couple. Bringing up second and seven. Play is to him, fill again, and right up the gut. There we go. Brings up a third and inches off of a six-yard gain. We'll take it. We'll take it. All we really care about is positive yardage. Just keep it moving. Keep it moving forward. Third and inches off the counter off the right side. There we go. We'll take it. Nice little first down conversion by Hemfield. Hemfield is looking beastly out there today. Bringing up a first and ten. QB drops back. He has a guy. Oh, what the hell? Man, that's that BS trajectory right there, man. <laughs> I threw the ball with the wrong damn trajectory. I had my tight end wide open. All I had to do was float the ball over the linebacker. But for whatever reason, he threw a bullet pass directly to the backer. Damn it. Anyway, not the turnover. They hit their tight end wide open. He's running down the field off a 29-yard reception. And like that, they're back in business. Ah, man, look at how the momentum just swings like that. Got a first and ten. Oh, the QB's trying to make something happen. Nope. Nothing there. Is that the fullback? Looks like a fullback caught the ball. Weird. Why would we throw it to a fullback? Anyway, that play is swallowed up in the backfield. Bring up a second and ten. Hands off to the back, Gary. Nope. Defense is starting to come alive here. Whoever that linebacker is, is making plays today. Number 5-2 is getting it done. Brings up a third and 11. They're on the shotgun, spreading the field. Try to set up the screenplay. And we got that covered. So it's a fourth and six. They're punting. Well, maybe not because it's the end of the third quarter. And uh, we're up 14-7 still. But uh, just based on... Previous games, usually if, uh, yep, that's exactly what I was going to say. If if I'm leading going into the fourth quarter, or if they're marching down the field going to the, in the fourth quarter or whatever, and I stop them and it's a fourth and whatever, they'll usually go for it the very next play, which is exactly what they did coming out of the, uh, out of the end of the third quarter there. So, yeah. Anyway, it was a turnover on downs right there. We get the ball back. Jeffrey Hemfield with a nine-yard pickup situation here it's second down and one bringing up a second and one the clock is ticking it's about 235 left in the game trying to eat up a little bit of clock here hands the ball off to Hemfield. oh he sees daylight but he gets tripped up another nine yard pickup so that's back to back nine yard runs by uh Hemfield. he already has 122 yards rushing on the day off of 11 attempts not bad at all not bad at all Mind you, we still have two minutes and change to still go. Ah, nice little running back play to the uh, to the right side. Gets about a couple, maybe three yards. Bringing up a second and seven. Kirk Patrick drops way back. Oh, he's going for the dagger, and he got him. Way to be aggressive out there. Forget running out the clock, man, trying to be conservative. Stay aggressive, man, and go for the jugular, and that's exactly what we did there. Found his wide receiver wide open. Had about a couple steps on the DB. DB wasn't even paying attention. So that brings up, uh, we're in the fourth quarter here. Got about a couple minutes leading 21 to 7. Most cases, the game should be on ice, but I still got to play these two minutes out. Ah. Uh, still, it's just still throwing completions downfield. 14 yard pickup on the, on the pass play. And Johnson goes down with the sack. There we go. So that brings up a second and 16. Bill Whitaker, four tackles and two sacks on the day. QB's back in the shotgun. 
Empty backfield. Nowhere to go, and he's swallowed up again. Bringing up a third and 23. Defense is on fire right now, baby. Let's go. We got third and 23. Comes out in the shotgun. At least he has a back back there to protect him this time. See if that even helps. Our defense is hungry. Oh, look at that. Runs right around the back. Oh, my gosh. This is just a crazy, crazy defensive effort by my D-line right now. Notice, mind you, I'm not even bringing anybody else. It's just my line. My four-man D-line. And they're getting home each and every play. Look at this. Oh, my God. There's a fumble. Pick it up. Pick it up. There we go. <laughs> oh, man. That's just unbelievable. I have no idea as he celebrates in the end zone. Defense, man, if you guys would have played like this the whole damn game, we would have shut them out. But, I mean, I give you props. As long as they only scored seven points on us. Scores 28-7. After we kick the ball off for another touchback, they're not bringing that out. So, with 52 seconds to go, after that defensive score, it's, yeah, it's pretty safe to say this one's in the bag here. As Johnson drops back, tries to throw somebody, and he throws it out of bounds because everybody's covered. Our defense definitely came alive, man. Whatever coach said to our D in the, in the halftime meeting, it stuck with them because they came out ready to play the second half. Got to get those cats props. Once again, my four down linemen. And they're getting home. Is that Whitaker again? Looked like it. Oh, my goodness. That left tackle is getting beat, and they try to come out and max protect now. Oh, no, they sent the tight end in motion. Once again, oh, they set up a screenplay. Come on, get him. Good job. Brings up a fourth and four. Highly doubt they go for it. Nope, they're punting. Received the ball. Got about 32 seconds to go. Nice little return of 14. So this is pretty much it. Wow. As Hempfield just runs up the middle, nobody's even touching him. Got about 20, 23 seconds to go as we break the huddle. Actually, the game clock is ahead of the play clock by a second, so I could just sit this one out. So, yeah, with that said, this was week 10. Going ahead and uh, about to sign off here. Thank you for tuning in. This was a uh, number one ranked Georgia against uh, the number 25 ranked Florida Gators. I'm definitely sure they'll slide down quite a bit now. 28 to 7, baby. So nice win. Thank you all for tuning in. As always, I appreciate the views. And uh, if you haven't by now, go ahead and click that like button. Click that subscribe button if you haven't. And I'll check you out next week's video for week 11. brings this broadcast to a close. For EA Sports and Kirk Herb Street, I'm Brad Nessler. We'll see you soon for another edition of NCAA Football 14.